Tuesday the 12th of April today and I decided I'd like to vlog today to show how most of my journey has been so far and how I feel like I need to approach it with a different attitude. finished a workout we've been staying just outside of gyms quite a lot recently so that way we have toilets and showers nearby and we're also motivated to actually keep a routine so I'm actually enjoying the routine of going to the gym in the morning and then moving on however the problem is it's not a very beautiful place to stay it doesn't really inspire a lot of adventure curiosity and exploration so that's my, kind of the main thing that's been a problem up until now is we've been staying at places that are familiar and kind of boring and we've been stressing about money so then our, our main problem is that we're stressing about money too much and that's stopping us from enjoying ourselves and that's stopping any kind of inspiration to make money in a way that we enjoy it's a bit of a negative cycle that I feel I'm stuck in where I can't I, I feel too guilty to spend any money on exciting experiences which in turn reduces my motivation to do anything that inspires me and make a difference which is my long-term goal is to kind of create a life and create a living out of something that actually adds value to the world um, yeah in terms of eating which I feel like might be a point of curiosity for people um, we tend to eat out quite a bit, which also makes money a bit of a stress because um, we don't have any sort of kitchen in our little car setup. So right now I'm just eating leftover Indian food that we had from a restaurant last night. So we just stopped for petrol as well, which reminds me one of the biggest expenses, especially because of what's happening in the world right now, petrol prices are, have skyrocketed since we first started about four months ago. Um, and full disclosure, I suppose, like, I'm not making <laughs> any income at the moment. I've just been running through savings and seeing the number go down is really kind of like... But then again, it's by deliberate choice that I'm not working any jobs because I feel like it's been draining me and I essentially want to do this to feel like more inspired and motivated and alive. So we found this place called the Crystal Castle in Byron Bay and we decided to visit. It's about 50 bucks for entry for adults and 
We kind of use this as a, a way to overcome our hesitation to pay for experiences. Um, but yeah, have a look at the shots of walking around. It's a really beautiful place and definitely the kind of thing that I've been wanting to see more of. probably like two hours there maybe more um, maybe three and now we're at the library because Nick's got some editing to do for like freelance videos so he's got a bit of income doing that and I'm probably going to spend a bit of time researching things to do over the next couple of days and seeing what I can do with what footage I've got somewhere up there but the car park itself has a no camping sign and we didn't want to risk it so 